how much can we be uh, sure about the crucifixion of Jesus and whether he was indeed crucified? Right. I know in, I know in Islam, the, the, the teaching is that he, he was not actually uh, crucified. I think on a historical basis, Jesus was absolutely crucified. I, I think that there is, uh, on, as a historian, there's, there's almost no doubt about that. And in case, in case your audience doesn't know, I'm, I'm not, I don't identify as a Christian. I mean, I, I was raised a Christian, but I'm an atheist now. I'm not, I don't have a particular stake in any of this information personally. But I think the crucifixion of Jesus is one of the, is probably the best attested one of the best attested events of his life. Um, it is um, it's found all over the place in our early sources. It's even mentioned by non-Christian sources, and it's um, uh, it's a kind of a complicated thing for me to argue. Although I can at length if somebody wants me to. The, that it's it is not it's not the kind of thing that Christians would have made up about him if they wanted to make up legends. Um, if they wanted to make up something about Jesus, it wouldn't be that he got killed by the enemy, <laughs> tortured to death. Uh, they, what they would have made up is that he became the king and he's sitting on the throne in Jerusalem. <laughs> but they couldn't make that up because everybody knew it wasn't true. <laughs> and so they had to say, well, yeah, he got crucified. But then they ended up saying that because he was crucified, that, that was significant, that it was the plan of God. And um, But they're, they're kind of explaining it. They're not you know, they're explaining because they got to explain it because he was crucified. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The, the Islamic account is very strange. It is, it is that, um, I guess, that people think Jesus was crucified and that somebody was crucified, but it wasn't Jesus. It was just somebody else uh, yeah. who people thought was Jesus. Yeah. And it's a very strange thing to think. <laughs> well, it is. You know, and it didn't start with uh, with Islam. It actually, there's a, there's a Christian teacher in the second century named Basilides who was an mm. Austin. And he wrote a gospel. He wrote an Gnostic gospel. We don't have the gospel anymore, but we have a church father who quote who talks about it. And in his account, uh, what he says is that there. So there was a fellow in the gospels. Jesus is carrying his cross, and they impel somebody else to carry the cross for him to the place of crucifixion. And according to Basilides, what happened is this other person whose name was Simon from Cyrene, which is in North Africa. Simon Cyrene carries the cross, and when he gets there. Jesus pulls an identity switch. He's the son of God. He can do miracles. He makes Simon of Cyrene look just like him. <laughs> and then he looks just like Simon of Cyrene. And so the Romans think they're crucifying Jesus, but they're crucifying Simon. And Jesus is standing by the cross laughing. <laughs> and presumably Simon didn't think it was so funny because he's trying to help out here. <laughs> <laughs> Understandably so. Sign up now for the upcoming seminar at bartdermancom apostatechristmas and stay away from Islam. <laughs>